Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your6 Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your Xbox One wireless controller to your Xbox One. Coming up next on Your6 Studios. So I have my Xbox One wireless controller right here. Let's go ahead and turn on my Xbox One wireless controller. It's already going to connect to my Xbox One because I already have it synced but I'm gonna go through the motion with you guys regardless. So once you have your Xbox One controller turned on and your Xbox One gaming console turned on, go ahead and locate the sync button on your Xbox One. If you have the Xbox One S, it should be located under the Xbox symbol that's illuminated. If you look down here, there will be a sync button to press. On your original Xbox, if you follow the disk drive, the sync button should be located right about here go ahead and press the sync button and the xbox symbol will start to blink now go ahead and find your controller and press the sync button which will be located on the top of the controller right here now go ahead and press the sync button on the controller and the controller light will now blink and the xbox light will now blink when it syncs both lights will now be solid now, if you are still having problems syncing your Xbox One controller to your Xbox One, I suggest getting a micro USB to USB cable and plugging the USB end to the front of your Xbox One or the back of the Xbox One. And then taking the micro USB cable and plugging it in directly to your Xbox One controller. So this will be the quickest and most efficient way of connecting to your Xbox One controller. So if you are having any kind of issues, go ahead and try connecting with a wired cable and connect it directly to your Xbox One. If this video on how to connect the Xbox One controller to your Xbox One helped you out, make sure to leave this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more Xbox One videos coming up next on Your Six Studios.